Well, chances are you've done a little bit of shopping today. Black Friday is a yearly tradition in the U.S., but like most things this year, it's adapting to the times, and Katie Steiner shows us how. In a year like no other. That's by Man, I just bought the 75 inches TV. Shopping on Black Friday actually felt a little normal. I always come out on Black Friday um, just as a way to um, get a little bit of extra savings. It's kind of my yearly thing. It's pretty normal. I mean, I guess the only thing is you got to wait outside sometimes for the stores because it's you know, COVID and everything, but it's not too bad. Megan Flattery came out to shop in Roseville to get her Christmas shopping done, and she wasn't too worried about getting sick. I was like, you know what? I'll, if I wear a mask, I'll be safe, I'm pretty sure. Aaron Bauman said there were a couple of differences shopping this year. Everyone was wearing a mask, which is always comforting as well, and I was going to say they kept the numbers low in the store. It wasn't like years before where you can barely move an inch, so it was, I felt fairly fairly safe there. You know, I just know all I noticed was people just wearing masks. Yeah, that was the only difference. I mean, a lot of people weren't staying distance and we were guilty of that also, but it's kind of hard when you got a lot of people in there to stay six feet. So I mean, pretty much they were staying six feet, six, three, four feet, which is fine. A lot of good sales. Joanne Bitterman and her sister Pat said even though they weren't the recommended six feet apart, they still felt perfectly safe. Oh, 100 percent. Yes. God, yes. I wasn't afraid I wasn't, at all. Not at all. Not no. At all. And with people's comfort levels all over the board, Bauman took precautions to make himself feel safe. I have hand sanitizer with me everywhere I go, so if I'm worried about stuff getting touched or anything like that, I always just make sure to use extra hand sanitizer, keep my distance. It's more putting myself in situations where I feel comfortable, keeping myself six feet apart, not putting it more on myself than the people around me. Katie Steiner, WCCO 4 News. Good luck in that TV in that car. The National Retail Federation expects sales to increase between 3.6 and 5.2 percent this year, with stores raking in up to $767 billion.